Hi guys, so are you ready to draw with me today? So today I'm going to draw you a scorpion. This is actually a request that I got to draw a scorpion and a cobra. So I will be drawing a cobra soon as well. So I hope you like it and let's get started. So we're going to start off with the head area and then build our scorpion from there and if you're new to my channel and haven't been here already please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and the bell icon to get a video every single day because I release a video for you every single day and I will also give you some fun facts about scorpions along the way while we draw and I will also show you how to color it as well and I'll show you how it all looks at the end of this video so if you have any requests for me to draw for next time please let me know in the comments below I will draw that for you um, and uh, if you like this video don't forget to hit that like button down below as well so now let's get to the rest of the drawing and I'll give you some fun facts along the way and before I forget this is a request from Josh so Josh I really hope you like it and I'm also going to draw you a cobra really soon and I will let you know um, soon when I do that and uh, I hope you like that one as well So I'll give you some fun facts now about scorpions. So scorpions may have been there long before even dinosaurs apparently. Um, so scorpions may be the oldest land animals still living today. So the fossil records suggest ancient scorpions were among the first marine animals to venture onto dry land. which happened about 420 million years ago um, during the Silurian period. So the earliest known dinosaurs evolved about 240 million years ago and modern humans only date back about 200,000 years which means we're roughly uh, 2100 times younger than scorpions. So Today I'm reading the website treehuggers.com, actually treehugger.com if you want to go and check out these facts that I'm reading to you today. Uh, they are uh, really good because they even have like some photos that you can look into um, which uh, makes it very interesting and gives a lot more detail. So if you want to go and read that you can. And they're also not considered as insects. So going back to the drawing, this part is very easy. You just have to keep adding and uh, making it smaller and smaller as it goes to the tail and then we'll finish off the tail with that uh, feature that the scorpions have at the end of the tail and um, we'll go into coloring after that but we need to add the legs and few more other details before we go into coloring. And another interesting fact that I find that scorpions are unique in, they do not lay eggs, they uh, give birth to young scorpions itself. The babies may be born 2 to 18 months after um, mating, uh, depending on the species, and look like adult, adult scorpions, only much smaller with a soft white body. They quickly clamber onto their mother's back, 
who is known to fiercely defend them until it's time for them to move on and uh, this website has a picture of them there are so many uh, tiny scorpions on top of a mother scorpion so it's an interesting photo to look at and um, some other fun facts some baby scorpions stay with their mom for two years crazy and uh, also they glow in UV light adult scorpions have fluorescent chemicals in their hyaline layer part of the um, cuticle in their exoskeleton that cause them to glow under ultraviolet light and there is a picture of that too if you want to check it out it's really cool um, that uh, picture just to look at and scientists aren't entirely sure what ev evolutionary advantage this offers scorpions but theories include helping protect them from sunlight interesting and some scorpions can go a year without food scorpions primarily prey on insects and spiders but some larger species may also take small lizards or mice so i'm reading a lot of facts because i find it very interesting to learn about scorpions i've never really uh, learned or re read about scorpions before so it's very interesting facts and i did not know that they glow in uv light and that they give birth to little scorpions i thought because they look kind of like a spider they probably uh, lay eggs but uh, apparently not and their venom can include dozens of different toxins wow all scorpions have venom but that venom is diverse and complex of 1500 known species only about 25 are thought to be capable of killing humans Still, that 2% of species can pose a serious threat to human life in some parts of the world, especially where medical treatment is difficult to access. So um, the death stalker of North Africa and the Middle East is often cited as one of the deadliest scorpion species on earth, along with the Indian red scorpion and the Arabian fat-tailed scorpion. So there you go. A single scorpion may produce venom with dozens of individual toxins, including neurotoxins, cardiotoxins, uh, nephrotoxins, and hemolytic toxins, as well as a wide variety of other chemicals like histamine, serotonin, and tri tryptophan. And some Toxins are more effective on certain kinds of animals such as insects or vertebrates um, and scorpions use their venom both to um, subdue prey and to protect themselves from predators as well. So going back to the drawing you can see that I started coloring. I started coloring with my prism color color pencils because it gives a nice blend and first I used blue color but I'm also going to add a lot more colors and as you can uh, you probably know that scorpions come in so many different colors like they have different shades of color so it's up to you which color you want to use I kind of wanted to go with like a black shade but uh, with like um, colors like purple blue and even brown I used all those colors as well so you will see it at the end of this video when I'm showing you uh, the full color drawing as well so now that I showed you how I colored it a little bit I'm going to show you the full color drawing so you can get an idea of all the colors that I've used so this is the full color drawing so I hope you like it and if you do like it don't forget to hit that like button down below and leave a comment for me 
and uh, don't forget to check out my Redbubble shop link in the description box below for products with this scorpion on. I really hope you like it. And now I'm going to put some next videos for you to check out next. I hope you love those as well. And don't forget to hit on my face logo to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day because I release a video every single day. So I hope you have a really great day and I hope you enjoyed learning about scorpions today. So I will come tomorrow with another video. So then I will see you tomorrow. Bye.